Dr. Frederick Ogola Onyango, the university lecturer facing allegations of killing his wife, has been admitted at Nairobi Hospital after he collapsed in police cells. Police obtained orders to detain the Don for 10 days to enable them to complete investigations into the death of his wife, Rebecca Gobi Machongo. Well, police suspect that she died after a physical fight with her husband, a claim Dr. Onyango denies. A post-mortem revealed that there were no physical injuries on the body of the deceased, as Steve Juma now reports. Dr. Frederick Ogola, a Strathmore University lecturer, was arrested following the death of his wife on New Year's Day. The car that I used before. He was rushed to Nairobi Hospital last night from Dagoretti Police Station after collapsing in the cells at 7 p.m. Police were alerted of the lecturer's condition by other inmates who were shouting. They found him sprawled on the cell's floor, unconscious, and rushed him. Chief Government Pathologist Johan Senodur, who examined the body of Rebecca Gobi Mwachongo, said the 27-year-old had fluid in the lungs. The pathologist also found that the deceased had a blood clot in the heart. More samples have been taken for further analysis. The lecturer denied engaging in a physical fight with the wife before her death. That this was a normal heart attack because Becky was admitted HDU with acute stroke. That's what the doctor wrote on the forms. Uh, Becky's doctor came and reviewed the, doctor, the, the reports from when she arrived. So you maintain that maybe she could have died because of heart attack? It was heart attack. She was resuscitated twice. The lecturer was the one who took the disease to Empisha and later to the Aga Khan University Hospital, where she was pronounced dead. It's very unfortunate that Becky has passed on. This is a, a woman that I've loved, a woman who has who made me to not get a job from the US, get a job from the US and drop the job, Europe, and come back home in Kenya because that was the that was her condition for marrying her, by the way. Because I invited her for the graduation in the Euros, he refused to say it, he cannot come. So majorly she is the woman who has been at the center of my life and I've loved her and there are all signs to show that. The Don was arrested on Tuesday evening at his home in Lavington and was taken to court on Wednesday but did not take plea following a request from the Directorate of Criminal Investigations to have him detained for 10 days to enable police finalize the investigations. This murder incident is among over 100 cases that have been reported in various police stations in the country from the month of December to January. Steve Juma, NTV, Nairobi.